To be honest, I'd never heard of the first bank that treats you like a guy who says someone glued his ass to a toilet seat. This man came in and said he never heard of the first bank that treats you like a guy who says someone glued his ass to a toilet seat. Frankly, we weren't surprised. Our bank was originally known simply as the first practical joke bank. Then we became the first bank that laughs at you just like you sat on a whoopee cushion. Later, we were acquired by a larger bank, the first bank that treats you like a man who just sat on ketchup packets under the toilet seat. Then we merged with the first bank that snickers like you've got a kick me sign in your back. And finally, just two weeks ago, we became the first bank that treats you like a guy who says someone glued his ass to a toilet seat. I needed a loan, and I wanted to see what the first bank that treats you like a guy who says someone glued his ass to a toilet seat could do for me. The man came in and said he needed a loan. We asked him to take a seat. He declined. I spoke to a loan officer. We had the man speak to a loan officer. But first, we made him shout for help for 15 minutes. They asked me a few questions. We asked the man if he would pull our finger. <laughs> we also asked if he would get on the intercom and page Harry Groin. To make a long story short, I got the loan. We gave the man the loan, but just to be funny, we put a die packet in the cash. The first bank that treats you like a guy who says someone glued his ass to a toilet seat. We may ignore our customers for a little while, but we always help them in the end. Ha, <laughs> get it? In the end? The first bank that treats you like a guy who says someone glued his ass to a toilet seat. The best bank in town. No ifs, ands, or buts. Ha, <laughs> buts. I am killing myself over here. Uh, how about this one? We'll hang on to your assets. You bet your bottom dollar. You like that?